Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your dude, Chris. I have autism here. Hit me well up with another video. Yeah, I'm gonna go get myself some coffee, and I'll be right back. Yeah, my coffee water is heating up right now. I know I'm doing a bunch of videos in a row, and, and it's just because I feel like it. Uh, yeah, so I got my paycheck, and I haven't cashed it yet. I'm going to cash it tomorrow, and I'm really looking forward to the next paycheck. Can't wait till open season to do my, my tax again so I can finally stop paying so much money a month. Get back to paying only 20 a month. Instead of like 600, it's ridiculous. It's Obamacare, I think, yeah. <sighs> well. I think my water's done heat. The water's done heating up. I'm gonna go get that and I'll be right back. So yeah, my friend Julia, we not, we're, well, I, I don't know, I could say my friend, but she was my friend, we're no longer friends. I got, I expressed, I got angry at her, and kind of yelled at her, and she unfriended me. You know, I apologized, but then I took the apology back for expressing how I felt. I'm just angry about it still, and I think I will be for a very, very long time. Because, you know, she had made the promise that we would be boyfriend and girlfriend and I kept trying to you know work on the building blocks to get there and apparently that didn't work and you know I got impatient you know I don't I, and that's just the way I feel you know if you if a girl comes up to me and says you want to if you want to get together and then I don't play that game anymore you know with the waiting game if you agree to something you agree to it I don't play the waiting game. I don't play that complicated bullshit. I don't. I'm not down with that mess. She works two hours a day, and she doesn't. And she complains a lot. This friend friend I I had, and I I'm talking about. She only she has autism just like me, mild autism. And, like, the stuff she complains about, I'm a much harder worker than she is. I could hit farther than she could ever get. I don't even know why the hell I'm even beating myself up about this. I had feelings for her. I don't know why. I'm going to work tomorrow with a brand new attitude. 
I might have pushed the envelope by being a little bit of a creep by going back to her place and apologizing for getting angry, but I should have never apologized now that I come to the conclusion that I was only expressing how I felt, and I should never apologize for that. Only going back to her place to apologize. Now, I should have just left it there and left it alone, and I slept it at that. I don't know. It just took me a while to think things through, but now I want nothing to do with her. I'm still angry about it. I'm still hurt about it. But all it all things come to an end sometimes. It's just the way it is. You find out the hard way and that's just life. Life is a bitch. You don't always get what you want. That's just fucking life. YouTube. I was on the rebound. I didn't even know it. I was on the motherfucking rebound. But that doesn't matter. I still got my whole life ahead of me. I just hope that cops don't come to my workplace tomorrow thinking I harassed her. I, I didn't. I don't even want nothing to do with her, to be quite frankly honest. And it kind of sucks that I work in the same workplace as her, given the circumstances that I don't want to be around her. And I'll, after the, I'll eventually come around her at some point in time and have to see her face. And that would be hard for me to mount a mustard, given the circumstances right now. I don't know what's going to happen in a long time, so around the road, a month down the road from now, but hopefully by then I'll be over it. Kind of. Well, just over to the point to where I don't even give really give a shit about it. You know what I'm saying? That's basically the same thing as being over it. Meaning you know about it, but you don't give a shit about it. Well, it's time to forget everything I've done. It's kind of sad that, you know, we had a good thing going and... I don't, I don't, I mean, I'm not going to apologize for getting mad at her. I express how I felt. And I wanted nothing less than to be boyfriend and girlfriend with her. And apparently I couldn't take, I couldn't be her friend. I, I thought I could and I couldn't. Learned to that the hard way. Thought I could. Thought I could pull through with this. And apparently I could not emotionally do it. I couldn't bring myself to do it. It just got out of control. I lost control. I made the mistake of doing so. But at the same time, I don't regret making that mistake because... I am, I'm free, um, finally would be free of this burden and finally learn this lesson that I would never settle for anything less and I would ma never make any compromise. And anybody who's not, isn't, who isn't down with that isn't down with me, dating wise. Yeah, be a forever and lonely, but I'm sure there's somebody as crazy and and demented as I am, probably. But whatever, it's just the way it is. Man, I'm just another fucking incel in the cell block of things, but whatever. I think my, co my coffee's done. I'll be right back. I think a lot of people at work are just jealous of my skills because I'm a sexy autistic beast. I'm just a big, fat, sexy autistic beast. And I got a lot of me to, to, to give and love. So much love. See, so much love. I'm just a sexy autistic beast. Uh, who, has a, who has a higher valuation for taste, you know. Julia, my friend, my wh who was my friend, was so stupid because she thinks that because I recorded her, I was attempting to record her, that somehow they would hack her phone. How, logically, how the fuck would somebody hack your phone just because somebody else records you, records you, because somebody, because I'm using my phone to record, was going to use my phone to record her to, to get the truth out. But she knew I was recording, so I had to stop. And, you know, I guess I was also being a little too nice in the moment, you know, before I could come to the conclusion of anything like I did now. And finally realizing that I was only wrong for going there, but not wrong for expressing my anger. I make no apologies whatsoever. 
I exercise my rights to the First Amendment, to the free will, and I make no apologies and I've taken nothing back. If I went back there again, it would just completely be utter harassment. But I want nothing to do with her, so I have no problem with keeping my distance from her. Just just talking about it right now brings pain, but it, it's also good to talk about something to get off your chest sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Which can be a little self-contradicting given the circumstances of which I'm talking about it right now. So... Oh well. It is what it is. Nothing's perfect. I hate liars. I hate people who lie about what they do to stay away. Like, that's not a true friend. Like, the lack of communication, lack of connection. I hated it. People like Marley, like, uh, Autistic Queen and, um, Mor and Morgan, whatever, Morgan Freeman, I don't know. Whoever this guy, kid's name is, I met him for you now and all for a connection of somebody I used to know. Another a dilemma with a girl with autism who, she, well, in this case, didn't like the way I joked, and I would say a lot of dirty, nasty uh, jokes, and I like making perverted jokes, and she didn't like what I was saying, poo and pee-pee balls and vagina and shit of that nature. You know, I like making dirty jokes. But I do got my one friend on Facebook who set me up with this girl, but the, it's not my fault. It's not her fault, this girl just, you know, little... Cuckoo in the caca. <laughs> hack her phone, please. How is anybody going to hack her phone by me recording? If anything, they'd probably hack my phone. I've been hacked so many times. Oh my gosh, don't even get me started. Oh, I've already got myself started. Hacking. Man, I've got so hacked. I've lost nearly 600 I've lost hundreds of dollars. 500 600 dollars And never got that money back, back in 2012. When I was going on adult websites and using my credit card to purchase, like, memberships on, like, Reality Kings and shit of that nature. And watching all these different pornos. Now I'm just chilling like a villain. Making a killing. Chilling like a villain. Making a killing. Yeah, boy. Do 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 do. I would want to play music, but I might get a copyright strike if I play music on this uh, ch on this video, and I can't do that. Yeah, so I'm going to be looking over some stuff. Let me plug my phone in so that doesn't run out of juice. Going down the street, smoking, jamming, sipping on jamming juice. Way back. With the money in my money in my money in my mind. Rolling down the street, smoking, jamming, sipping on jamming juice. Way back. I have money in my money in my money in my mind.
Okay. I don't. I'm just going on a website right now. I'm going on Facebook, and I'm going to like just look at some posts and what have you. I don't know why I even logged into Ying Yank. I don't know what brought me to bring to log into that account. I wish I never did log into that account. I don't know why I did, but I did, and I want to sign out now. So. That is a bone, that is a boner blocker. Uh, the only mobile launcher porn would be a boner blocker. I want to, I have to go on here. Oh, of course. I'm going on the wrong one. <laughs> I gotta go through Chrome instead of uh, Opera Browser because, uh, you know, because, you know, shit. Right? Yeah. I love Chrome. Certain websites don't play fairly with, with certain streamings. I miss, I still miss having to use Google Hangout to live stream, man. It was so much fun. Yeah, boy. Yeah, even if I lost my job at Wendy's, I always have a fallback plan. At least I have the time to relax. I was a much happier person, and maybe I was, there's a time, there's points I wish I had never gone to. And, and I just, there's just the things I wish could and couldn't be. It's just a weird series of events of wishing uh, what and what have you. I've even getting so many friends' requests on here. Friend request is. And I got, I'm just getting like crazy now that I've entered Chrome. Oh my god. Chrome! Uh, so. Uh, thank you. Well, anyways. I'm looking at Marley Dubs right over on the, I'm looking at Autistic Queen right now on her, on her Facebook. Oh, sweetie. You're the best friend I ever had. And. Unfor I can't. Unfortunately, I can't say the same for everybody else. Unfortunately. But, oh uh, well. It is what it is, you guys. I'm going to the messenger right now to, you know, read messages. I want to read messages. 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 Alright. See all the mess messages. All the messages. I want to fly like an eagle. Do you see? Fly like an eagle where my spirit can raise me. I want to fly. Fly right into the future. Donkey sensibly into the future. Donkey sensibly into the future. Donkey sensibly, and we'll see. Come on now, fly. Fly right into the future.
Well, I'm done here. Peace, peace.